Welcome back, on this video I will go through the pre-trip inspection for code 14, namely code EC, first I will go through the inside and the outside, this inspection you will do before starting with the yard test, let's begin with the inside inspection. First you will, look under the vehicle for any leaks or obstructions, go to the front and pull wiper away from windshield, then climb into the vehicle, now you will start with the inside inspection. Mention that all the doors are closed, hand brake is up, and the gears is in neutral. The seat and mirrors are adjusted correctly, and there is no obstructions in the vehicle. You will then switch the vehicle on without starting, and then mention that all warning lights and meters are working. Now the examiner will ask you to test the following, park lights, dim lights, headlights, front left and right indicators, wipers, hooter, brake lights, back left and right indicator. After you have tested the lights, switch off all the lights and then start the vehicle, and climb out. You will start with the right side reflectors and reflecting tape, mention that it is clean and intact. Then the right front wheel, check if the tire tread and pressure is fine, mention that there is no damage on the side of the tire, the valve is closed, and that the nuts are fastened and there is no leaks. The right headlight and indicator is clean and intact, you can also say that both is in working order. The right and left wiper is clean and intact, and the wiper blades has no cracks. The two top lights is clean and intact. You will then mention that the bonnet is closed, and that you already checked the water, oil, brake fluid and fan belt, also the number plate intact and valid and agrees with license disc. Now again you will check the left headlight and indicator, you can say both is checked same as the right side. Also the left side reflectors and reflecting tape is clean and intact, same as opposite. The left front wheel check same as right front wheel. The battery is secure. And fasten, and then also check if the power cable near cable is connected correctly. Next check the double back wheels, Mention you check them the same as right front wheel, and also mention that there is no obstructions between them. The left back lights on truck and chevron is clean and intact. Now you will go over to the trailer you will start with the landing gear is lifted and the safety pin intact, also mention that the park brake of the trailer is released. Next the double wheels on the trailer is checked the same as the wheels on the trucks, no obstructions between them. All the lights, reflectors and chevron at the back is clean and intact, same for the number plate it is also clean and intact and correspond with the front one. The right double wheels have been checked the same as on the left, and the landing gear of the trailer also checked the same as on the left. Rear lights of the truck is clean and intact, and registration plate is valid and is the same as the one in front as well as the disc. The fifth wheel is engaged and the safety lock intact. The diesel cap is closed and there is no leaks. The left air pipe attached correctly, then climb in vehicle and wait for instructions from examiner. After you have done the yard test, and on your way to the road test, first you must do the starring procedure, you will start by saying that the hand brake is up and gears are in neutral then star the engine, mention that all warning lights are off and gauges are working, mention that vehicle has no choke, mention that air pressure is correct, and then all done, thank you for watching, until next time please like and subscribe.